Oh, thanks, baby. I'm gonna look with Pat. I don't know. When's she down here? No. Pat, we're back. Pat! You okay, love? Yeah, fine. You're not ill or anything, are you? No. No, I, I just overslept. I'll be down in a minute. Right. Hey, you know, I missed you last night. Right? Yeah? I said I missed you last night. I missed you too. Well, she hadn't gone. I'll see you downstairs, yeah? Okay. Morning, my son. Take a seat. What's going on? I've made you breakfast. You've made me breakfast. Don't sound so surprised. I'm sorry, it's just you know, I don't normally do it. That's all. Come on, come on to the house. Sit down, sit down. And get your laughing gear around that lot. Let's put all this on. Well, let's just say I've had a uh, change of heart, then. Eh? Any particular reason? Have you mind? No, I think you're wrong. You got I think we know that was very good by now. <laughs> All right, then, my love. Hey, you fancy a cup of? Yeah, please, yeah. All right, Mum? Yeah, fine. Just a bit tired, that's all. So, what did you get up to last night? Do you have anything interesting? Mm. No, nothing interesting. I had a bath, watched the telly, quite a night in, you know. <laughs> That'll be Dad. So, um, we didn't miss anything, then? No. No, nothing. Hello, darling. How's my favourite girl this morning? All right. Yeah, you got all your stuff ready, darling? Nearly. Ah, well, there's no rush. I've got all the time in the world. Ah, oh, good morning, everybody. Morning. So, how was your little business trip? Get yourself a load of nice new motors, did you? Yes, I did, actually. Good, good. So, well, how's your business coming along? Everything all right, is it? Oh, you know, it could be better, could be better. Oh, I'm sorry, Anna. Don't be. I've still got a few tricks up my sleeve. I bet you have. Well, look, shouldn't you be taking Janine off to school? I mean, you don't want her to be late, do you? Oh, she's never late when she's with me. I get done it. No. See? Right then, we'd better be off. I'll see ya. Babes. Ignore him. It isn't worth it. Yes, and uh, we need some more milk. We just ran out. Right, I'll see you about 8.30 then, yeah? What about you do at Manor Wood? Oh, well, I'll start the proceedings off and then I'll make a discreet exit. Well, don't you want to stay for the old thing? <sighs> Not really. Another evening spent with a bunch of car salesmen isn't exactly my idea of fun, you know. Besides, I'd rather be with you. I love you, Roy. And I love you. It's all right. Oh, um, hang on a sec, right? Yeah? Um, you got any of those invites left? For tonight? Yeah, yeah, of course. Yes, sir. I'm There's on. a dealer over at the door still, I think we should invite. Yeah, all right. There you go. Invite who you like. Oh, all the merrier. Cheers. Thanks. David's there. Oh, it doesn't matter. That's must go somewhere else, baby, because I need you. I need you. I need you. Frank, please, I don't want anybody to see us. I don't know. They're going to find out sooner or later, aren't they? Have you told Roy yet? No, I haven't had a chance. Yeah, you're going to tell him, baby, aren't you? Frank, you can't expect me to turn my whole life upside down just like that. Don't, darling, you, you, you do feel the same as you did last night, don't you? 
Say what's wrong, sweetheart. I mean, you do feel the same, please. Say you do. Yes, I do. I feel the same as I did last night and the night before and every other night. Hey, what's the problem, man? Tell him. Get it over with. I need time. Then why, darling? Don't push me, please, Frank. I'm not Frank. pushing you, sweetheart. I just don't want things to drift. That's all, love. I need time to think. Darling, don't you understand? I need to be with you now, babe. Now. Oh. I'll, um... I'll, I'll phone you maybe around lunchtime, as soon as I get a chance. No, don't, don't leave it too long, by please. No, I won't. Yeah, good girl. Yeah, good girl. 6.30. Manor Wood. Oh, right, OK. Well, I'll tell you what, I'm coming over your way this afternoon, so I'll, I'll drop an invite in for you. All right, smashing. See you then. Ta-da. What was all that business with Frank this morning? What business? The look you gave him. I didn't give him any look. I saw you, Mum. You know I did, so don't deny it. Look, I'm not having a go at you. I just want to... I just want to know what's going on. Nothing's going on. Well, did you talk to him? Yes, I talked to him. And? What did he say? Did he say anything about confessing? He said he'd rather go to prison than take charity from Roy. So he's going to confess then? I don't know. We talked, and then... And then what? Um... We got sidetracked. Sidetracked? Yes. What's going on, Mum? I told you, David, nothing's going on. Now, will you just go and leave me, please? I've made a terrible mistake, Kath. I... What have you done? <laughs> I've slept with Frank. Oh, 
the hell are you doing? I'm here with the party, you know. Get your hands up with me. You're not welcome here, Frank. I said get your I hands up with me. I think you better go now. <laughs> what are you going to do with it? Beat me up in front of your mates, are you? <laughs> I don't think so. That's better. Now get out of my way. Excuse me. Frank. What a nice surprise. Now, everybody, this is uh, Frank Butcher. You've probably heard of him. I want to work with you. Well, as you can see, now isn't really a very good time. I said I want to work with you. Now, either you can do it in front of all these people, or we can go somewhere a little more private. It's up to you, isn't it? But I thought you didn't want Frank. If it's there for months, it was over. I know I wanted it to be. I wanted everything to be simple. So what now? You still in love with him? Up to last night I thought I might be, but sleeping with him sorted that out. It felt so wrong. Have you told Frank that? I wanted to, but I panicked. I don't want to hurt him. Well, you haven't got much choice, have you? I mean, he, he's going to realise pretty soon, isn't he? And what about Roy? Does he know yet? No. Well, are you going to tell him? I don't know. I don't think he could cope. Pat, secrets never work out. You know that. Yes, but telling him might destroy everything. And what's it going to do to you if you don't? You don't understand, Kath. He'd never forgive me. How do you know he wouldn't? Pat, he loves you. I don't want to lose him. You won't. Besides, what choice have you got, eh? If you don't tell him, Frank will. Yeah. Very impressive, Roy. You're a uh, man of taste. Thank you. Well, what can I do for you? I'll come with a little chat. Chat? That's right. What about? About my wife. What about her? Well, in your absence last night, we had a, um, a little get-together. What are you trying to say, Frank? What do you think I'm trying to say? Now, look, I've got people out there. I can't spend time talking to you. We slept together, Roy. You're lying. Am I? Yes. It's just some sick fantasy that you'd like to be true. I slept with her, Roy. Get on. Go on. Get out and take your... Your filthy mouth and your filthy life. Hey, 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 hey! There's nothing filthy about it. We love each other. We always have done. And last night was just like old times. In our bed together. Some place where you should never have been. And I'll tell you something else. It was as good as it always was. You're lying. Pat would never do that. She wants me, Roy. Just like she always did. No. She despises you. Not anymore. Now you're gonna have to face it, my old son. You can ruin my business, you can live in my house, but you can never take my pet. <laughs> yeah, Roy. It's your turn to be out in the cold. Wait, 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 I'll go down and hold that. Roy! Roy! You all right? What happened? Go back inside, David. But don't listen to him, he's off his head. And what does it you think he said to me? Oh, I don't know, he's, he's probably just stirring out again as usual. Look, David, why don't you go back inside and put your face around? That's what you're here for, isn't it?
Hello, love. Roy? What's going on? What are you doing? Roy? I'm leaving. What do you mean? Pat, it's, it's over. What's happened? It doesn't matter. I, I, I can't cope. I, I just Roy, can't cope. will you please tell me what's happened? I know about you and Frank. He came to see me. He told me that you slept together. I should have known it. It, it wouldn't last. It was a mistake right from the start. Roy, listen. Oh, Pat, please, just let me go. It's not true. Oh, come on. He told me everything. He's lying. He told me you did it in our bed. I couldn't satisfy you until you went back to Frank. And if I hadn't been Frank, it would have been somebody else. Roy is lying. I would never do anything to hurt you. So, you didn't come round here last night? Well, yes, but we just talked. Talked? Yes. What the, why did he tell me they just slept together? I, I don't know. Maybe he wants it to be true. He wants to believe it. Can't you see he's trying to push us apart? Are you saying he made the whole thing up? Yes. But it was so convincing. Roy, it didn't happen, love. Believe me, it, it didn't happen. Oh, God, how could I have been so stupid? How could I believe his, his filthy little story? Oh, no, don't, Roy, please don't. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm so, so sorry.